the only job they had left in the whole of the Yukon was, they said, it was in a little place called Carcross. And I said, has it got mountains? And they said, yeah, plenty of them. I said, right, I'm there. My primary medium is acrylic paint. And, uh, and I, uh, I do most of my paintings in acrylics. Well, the idea of serigraphs came to me because I was given the idea. If I'm doing a serigraph, it's painted especially for a serigraph. My friend does the, the actual printing of the serigraphs, but when I'm designing a serigraph, I don't use as many colours, you know, there's a limit. I do the, the design and, uh, and then I send it to Michael. I will uh, correct a colour or suggest a colour or do something and this has worked very well. Michael, he, can, he's, he gets into my way of doing it and he can tell what he should do with the colours. I wish I could see more of Michael, he's an interesting person. And uh, he's a brilliant craftsman, you know, when he's working. Uh, he's a perfectionist and he does it right. And it's printed on the most expensive French made paper, you know. a few artist proofs and then you do more for for selling you know for the public and then you just cut them off I keep the 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 paintings I've done for the prints but uh, they have numbers on them and that so they they're not very pretty oh yeah well Serigraphs, it's, it's a discipline and uh, it's the nearest thing to a painting that an artist can do. Anything that I see with a cup of tea is worth going to see. <laughs>